The hero returns. Yep. Mr. Morgan, bring me some materials, and I'll be glad to make something nice for you. <laughs> I suppose I never thought of it quite like that. You never read? I'll need you to go find me the right materials before I can make that. I've just not chosen to. <laughs> well, maybe one of us will teach you. Talk to you a minute. Not again, Abigail. Not ever. Just leave me alone, will you? You pathetic. You're a pathetic man, John Marston. Don't I know it? You seen this grim I reckon I'm gonna think. About we're gonna run out of meat here soon if we're not careful. Sorry, got nothing for you right now. Hey, Arthur! What you want? Man, you want a sour son of a bitch, ain't you? Only when I see you. <laughs> Only when I see you. <laughs> You're getting nowhere fast, my boy. Dutch? Miss O'Shea? Well, feels like we are finally getting back on our feet. You, uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet, but Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Feels like things have changed. The whole world's changed. But they don't want folk like us no more. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust Dutch, Mr. Morgan. You have to. They got Micah! Dutch! Arthur! <clears throat> What's going on? They got Micah. He, he's been arrested for murder. He was in Strawberry It's okay, and... son. Breathe. <sighs> they nearly lynched me. They... They got Micah and the sheriffs in Strawberry. And there's talk of hanging him. Here's open. Arthur. What? The fool brought this on himself. 
You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No, I ain't saving that fool. I can't go. My face will be all over, Wesbeth. I am asking. He would do it for you. I don't think he would, but... I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Come on, son. I'll get to it, Dutch. Just can't drop everything. Come on, girl. Yeah. I rode as fast as I could. Didn't stop for nothing. Yeah, you look like you've been through it. I'm beat. We finally get off that mountain, then this. Micah's got a crazy side offer. What were you boys doing? You were supposed to be scouting ahead for him. I kept asking him what we was doing, but he was, you worry too much, kid. Just, just some business to attend to, kid. You know how he is. Yes, I do. He was half soaked before we even got there. Then we ran into some fellas. One of them Micah knew, drank some more. And this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. Then he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even tell you quite how. It happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast, too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. You're all right now. We'll take care of it. So you're gonna go get him? I'll come with you. No, uh, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. Forget about Mac. It was drank that started all this. We'll just have a cup. Settle you down, then head back. Okay? We'll just have a cup. Settle you down and head back. Okay? Here we are. Hey, are you blind? Hey, watch yourself. Hey, watch yourself. Welcome. Thanks, partner. Just one or two, right, Arthur? Of course, just a drink. No big drama. Can we get a couple beers, please? You, I don't want no trouble. And you'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. Here, have one for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Micah seemed to know a lot of people. That was the problem. How you mean? I mean, I done seen a lot of crazy, crazy a stuff, but Mike... A lot of crazy, crazy stuff. Will you shut up? Will you shut up? Be quiet, buddy. <laughs> oh, they're dullards. My lord. You men is dull. <laughs> <laughs> and leave this fool alone. Leave the fool alone. People been leaving me alone for the last ten years. Hey, buddy, you don't shut up. I'm gonna rip your head clean off your shoulders. Is that clear? Get out of here! Clear? Clear? Very clear. I'm on my way. <laughs> oh. Mm. Oh. <laughs> That's great, partner. Lenny, Lenny, where are you? Found my friend. You know where we went? Don't know. Hey, Lenny! Lenny? Uh, Lenny? Uh, Get out! Oh. 
Sorry. <laughs> La 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 Shut your mouth, mister Peach snaps I'm pissing How many of you had, pal? Where's Lenny? Lenny! I'm Clyde. You got the wrong fella. I've been looking all over for you, Lenny. Lenny! What are you talking about? I can't find Lenny. Do I look three people watching? Guys, you know they can see your public comments, right? Can you actually? Dude, that's great. Hi. Dude, that's great. I wonder who the other person watching is. I have no idea. Can you see who it is? Like what their name is? Why? Well, I gotta talk to this other view I have. We can't leave we can't leave him out of the loop. Who else is here? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Dude, who knows? Aww. Two watching. Aww. Oh, I got caught by the cops. Oh, I got knocked out. What are you doing? I know what you're doing. Never mind. You! Why are you standing up? What do we do? I don't know. Me neither. Yeah. You pair yeah. degenerates. Ugh. There's a fine for drunken violence in this town. You're just lucky no one was killed. Hey, we didn't start a thing. <laughs> yes, you did. Well, I don't remember. <laughs> Either you fools got any money, ten dollars, and you're free to walk. Sure. Now, get out of here. 
I don't want to see either you around here no more. So, that was a quiet drink? First one was pretty quiet. <laughs> yeah, the first one was pretty quiet. At least it took your mind. Y'all better still be watching. I'm doing my PowerPoint. I'll watch it. Well, that's certainly Good. true. I gotta get out of here. I'm just gonna have a little sit down. Feel sorry for myself. Oh. 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 Where'd my gun go? Uh. Yeah, I got one person watching. I'm gonna go get a haircut. I'm gonna get a haircut. Left part, middle parted. All right. This cut will look after itself. You guys want to see something cool that I can do? Yeah. Alright, watch this. Right then, you are all set. No brawling nice, this time, alright? Emily, are you messaging? Are you messaging me back? I'm Luke Tom Cook uh, kept talking to the law. So they made a food. Hello again. Please. I need a bath. That's okay. Can you organize? Y'all watching? Yeah. Watch this. Yeah, okay. Sure. Sit back and relax, son. I'll be out of your hair in no time. Let me know if I'm scrubbing too hard, okay? Ah, you gotta treat yourself sometimes, I reckon. <laughs> yes, indeed. You let me know if you need anything, all right? Let me know if you'd like a bit of an extra scrub anywhere. Bye, hun. Rooms are quiet and clean. Thank you. Just prove 
you was hoping I wouldn't recognize hey, Mo, you. Mate. I got some bad news. I'm a different man, sir. A good man. Come on, sir. Try to remember what really happened at Sylvia's Saloon back in 76. Just a lot of bunk, Plato. It's just a lot of bunk. It's not bunk, Mr. Calloway, sir. It's history. Ancient history. Done and dusted. The dead got off lucky. The living got to keep suffering. Same as always. But did you shoot the Newton twins? I don't give a pig's penis about the Newton twins. One of them was a girl, anyhow. But you had been friends back in 73. Who's your friend there? <laughs> Put that in your fucking book, Plato. This is Jim Boy Calloway. The Jim Boy Calloway. Who? The gunslinger. Fastest left-handed draw that ever drew breath. He once killed 14 men in a fight at Lucy Hollow. What are you waiting for? How do you mean? Well, I reckon right now, kill him yourself. I don't want to kill him. I want to deify him. He's a god. I'm trying to write his biography. Well, how's that going? I think I prefer the duel. Either I'd kill him and be able to be Baltimore's finest ever gunslinger, or he'd kill me and I could be set free from ever having to speak to him again. Well, you're starting to understand something very important. What's that? The joys of gunslinging. It's win-win. Freedom or glory. That's brilliant. I'm going to write that down, if I may. Be my guest. What's your name? I don't have a name. But you are a gunslinger. Not really. I mean, folks who need shooting, I try and shoot in the back. All that other stuff, it's, well, bunk. But you fought duels. Once upon a time, I may have. And you ain't interested in fame. <sighs> I don't think so. Strange. But you like fortune. I need money, sure. OK. And forgive me, mister, if I seem a little desperate. I am a little desperate. This book, I've got to make a thing of it. And, well, there's a whole list of gunfighters. Legends, every last one. Emmett Granger, Flacco Hernandez, Billy Midnight, Black Bell. Never heard of them. Maybe you can go and speak to them. Ask them about Callaway. Any of them get uppity, shoot them. I can't believe I just said that, but... You want me to go and find some sad, deluded fools like him, ask if he was the greatest, and then if they get up... Why do I need to speak? Him, does sound a lot Hello. Worse than it did in my head. How much you paying? Well, a lot. Half the proceeds of the book, if you help me get it written. I'll see what I can do. Ha! Oh, get photos. Okay. And there are notes on the back of those portraits that should lead you to him. Fuck you, Emily. I know what you're doing. You're not slick. You're not slick. Here are some other flop house. Yeah, I'm pretty bad. Sorry. Do it. gonna go take care of Emmett Granger real quick should be easy easy peasy lemon squeezy you goddamn moron, you goddamn moron. Yeah. who the fuck is dead in the train tracks over here oh fuck this is the fucking serial killer dude 
No, I'll fucking do that shit later. I don't fucking feel like it. I don't feel like fucking with that right now. Shut up. Oh, I missed. Uh, it's fine. I fucking missed. I'm so bad. I'm. I fucking suck. God damn it. John. Three watching. Ah, John's here now. Hell yeah. Unless he's been here. I just not got the. Oh, I got two watching now. The whole gang. Fine, do you want me to turn off my mic? Yes, yeah. Okay then. Granger? That's my name. And my occupation, too, if you hadn't noticed. Weren't always like that, though, were you? Used to be a quick draw guy. You knew Jim Boy Calloway? Used to be is correct. Then there's a long over. And who might you be? Don't matter. I need you to tell me about Jim Boy. Just a quote for a book. A book about Jim Boy? <laughs> well, shit. I can't talk to you now. Look at me. A knee deep in hog crap. Well, don't mind me. We can talk while you work. <laughs> I ain't talking and shoveling. Besides, young man like you get it done in half the time. I don't know about that. What's to know? You interested in the old days? You shovel this shit, I tell you some stories. You keep your hands clean, I don't give you squat. God damn it. These better be some stories. Oh, they are. Pick up the fork and get to work. Or get out of here and stop wasting my time. I'm gonna do this for you, but I don't like it. Jim Boy weren't nothing, you know. Me? I killed men, women, and children, too. Animals. I even killed rocks. And I killed them good. I shot folks, stabbed folks, skinned folks. I scalped some. Boy, they scream when you scalp them. Hey, let me work. Don't know what's got into these hogs, but I know what's coming out of them. <laughs> I bash folks, butchered folks. I burn folks alive. Bury folks alive. One time, I... Hey, I get it, all right? You're mean. What about Callaway? You have no idea, girlie. By a feminine type like you, I'd probably have chopped your head off, stuffed you, and eaten you like a sausage. No doubt. Now it's clean enough to eat off. Uh, I guess I'm done. Get that barrel to the shit pile, and I suppose you is. All right. No shortage of shit round here. Comes from hungry hogs and no hands. Ugh. Hell, Ugh. that stinks. <laughs> okay, I cleaned up your mess. Go on, tell me about Callaway. I said I'd tell you stories. I didn't say they'd be about him. Don't trifle with me, old man. You knew him. Just give me something, anything. You're making a book. You should make it about me. They're just words, is all. Give me something to say, and I'll leave you alone. You owe me that. Hey, you be careful. Killer like me, it don't take much to end up on the end of my knife. 
One time. You know I... what? I don't think you were anything at all. Just a crazy old man. I ain't a killer. Well, you'd already be hog feed. I hadn't made a deal with the Federals got this far. This is your last chance, Mr. Granger. Give me a quote from the book. Hey, hey, hey you don't you don't hit no man of peace, no government witness. <laughs> Calloway said you was full of piss, but he didn't tell me the half of it. I'm itching to drop you, girly. Only you ain't worth my time. I, I got too much to lose. Too much to lose? Well, seeing as I cleaned up this pig's die, I figure I'm in my rights to wreck it. Let's see. You don't want to do that? You walk away right now. Well, well. All I wanted was a quote. You don't know who you're trifling with. That's my stick! No. No. No! You did not! You just took yourself a regular shit shower, Mr. Granger. Boy, that's real nasty. You earned yourself a killing. And I'm gonna enjoy it now. Draw! It's gonna be the last thing you do. Yep.
medicine or a siphon. All right. All right. Quit moaning. Christ. Oh, oh God. Let's keep this between us. Oh, you saved my life. I owe you. Got that right. I do. Okay, girl. Oh. Oh. Now I, I gotta get out of here. No! Oh. Oh. much like it around here no more. Yeah. Nice. Hi. 